This is the fourth Catholic Episcopal Conference of West Africa, a week-long meeting of Catholic bishops of each of the 16 West African countries holding at the ECOWAS Secretariat in Abuja. Thank you so much. Previously held in Cote d'Ivoire, Ghana, and Burkina Faso, this edition has in attendance both religious and political leaders. And conversations here are focused on the teachings of brotherhood. The prevailing sentiment at this gathering is that terrorism, banditry, and other vices would drastically reduce if West Africans treat each other as brothers. Removing the roadblocks that cause exclusion will require collaborations between the church and political authority. And according to Nigeria's papal nuncio, the challenges facing the teaching of humanity first must be addressed. We need to make every effort to achieve a true conversion of mentality which overcomes tribalism and all other forms of division and opposition based on ethnicity or other affiliation of factors. For the Vice President, Professor Yemi Oshimbajo, despite efforts at integration in the West African region, there are still very salient challenges. He believes the solution can be found in a resocialization of West Africans at community levels. Peace cannot reign in our region if it does not first reign in our communities. By offering concrete prescriptions on building brotherhood and sustainable peace anywhere, the encyclical Fratelli Tutti rightly takes the position that it is not merely the business of governments and political institutions to find means of securing peace. It must also be anchored on our civil societies, of which our faith communities are an important constituency. The resounding phrase for this week-long conference is the term Fratelli Tutti, which literally means all brothers. The idea is that the Catholic Church in West Africa is banding together as brothers to pour its full influence on the communities in the region. With poverty and insecurity and a lot of devices going on in this region, they do have their work cut out for them. But I believe that meetings such as this one will create a roadmap that will determine what the teachings for the next few years will be. Kayla Megua, Channels Television News.